Everyone, this time around, I'm going to review something actually based on a blog reader suggestion because I mentioned in a blog called My Favorite Things, my camera bag, which is a Kata bag, the R103. Um, now, if you've watched these video reviews before, you'll know one of the challenges is for me trying to use that little webcam camera and figure out how to position it. So this should be even more fun with a great big bag like this. Here's what I love about this bag right away. Let me tell you, I've used this bag. I took it on a trip to Alaska in Maine. It's been through rain. It's been through, well, not quite snow, but close to it. I use it on a lot of trips, and one of the reasons I do is because along with the camera place, there's also a place for my laptop. So right in here, I slip my laptop in. I've got my laptop and a fair bit of camera gear at the same time. It's got a, a few features about it. First of all, it's very, very rugged, which I like, obviously, for that travel. There's two pouches right on the front here, so you can access things very quickly. Uh, but if I open it up, I'll try and do this without spilling everything all over the place here. You can kind of get an idea. Let's just tilt this down a bit. What I've got in here, I've got my camera extra lens, my Expo Disc, SB800, Gorillapod, quite a bit of stuff, Pocket Wizard, battery charger, and then up here on this part, this part here is also storage, so you can actually zip up here and get up inside and put things in here, plus there's a little pocket in here as well. The other thing that's great about this, when it is sealed up, if you need quick access to something, you can just open this front portion right here and have access to your camera and so on very very quickly so you don't have to go through and there's also a pocket on this part <laughs> isn't this fun right here for more stuff now it also comes with I don't have it with me also comes with a tripod carrying device that you slap on the front so you can put your tripod in and the other interesting thing I like about this is it's very customizable because in here comes with a weather cover by the way but also there's these little velcro pockets and they're basically just little mesh bags where you can put all kinds of things in here little batteries and everything else and just stick them in and you'll know that the velcro will hold tight and all of these dividers of course are removable with velcros and velcro so you can customize it so the bottom line is hold on there we go whoa 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 whoa, whoa. Okay, the, sorry, the fun of webcams. The bottom line with this bag is it wasn't the least expensive in the world, but for me, I needed the laptop capability. I take it on almost all my seminar trips so that I can use carry-on. I use this and a small suitcase for my clothes, and I'm good to go. I can put a lot of stuff in there, including some fairly big lenses. It's been very durable. My only minor complaint is it'd be nice if there were a couple of more zippable pockets for things but really that's just a minor complaint because overall I've had nothing but uh, success with it I really enjoy it I've actually got one for my daughter as well and probably be on my shopping list for my son now that he's into photography as well in fact if you look around our office you'll see quite a few of these because we like them so much we got them a whole bunch of them for a lot of our staff and the instructors who work at Photoshop World so I heartily recommend taking a look at these there's obviously lots of options out there for camera bags but particularly if you're looking as I was for one that has the lap, laptop plus camera and accessories option, the R103 is a very good choice. I highly recommend it.